Oh, wait, why? Why? Oh, it's, it's you again. Oh, uh, you gotta stop doing that. That's two days in a row, guys. Oh, welcome back to Stardew Valley, ladies and gentlemen. We're back. I'm very, very excited about that. Fire starter! We're back. I'm turning the fire off today. It's been burning too long. We've been wasting too many pieces of logs. Firewood is running short. All right. So today we're back in Stardew Valley. It's episode number five. Um, and we're gonna check the weather for tomorrow. Welcome to Conclusion Number Five. We're number one source for uh, weather, news, and entertainment. And now the weather for last one tomorrow. It's gonna be clear and sunny all day. Okay, so we, we we're definitely gonna have to water stuff tomorrow. Um, we might as well see what the fortune teller has to say as well. Ah, I sense that a new viewer has joined us. A young man from Stardew Valley. Welcome, welcome. Yes, I see. The spirits are very happy today. They will do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Yes, okay, good. So we have good luck today. I don't really know. I think that's just like prices in the shops, but I'm not sure. So, all right, we got some stuff to water. That's right. Oh, we had the, the special rice shoots down at the bottom. Oh, that's cool. I remember that. All right, so I, I don't I don't think I've ever had rice shoots before. So uh, I have to keep an eye on those and make sure I know what to uh, do with these. I don't even know how long they take to, to mature. So we're gonna have to just go go with the flow with those bad boys. Fill this bad boy back up. All right. So, um, it is still Saturday, so we cannot give another uh, daffodil to Haley today. So, we got to keep that in mind. What did I want to do? We were supposed to... Oh, that's right. Well, let's go ahead and do the geodes. Um, and we might as well sell some more stuff for some more money so I can sell that. We have to check out the... Um, we have to check out the... The plants as well. I didn't sell the parsnips. Oh no! Whoa! Wait, wait a minute. Hold the phone. We have to go check out the 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 mine shaft. The mine shaft. So I'm going to sell the parsnips. Um, actually, wait. I was supposed to give someone parsnips, wasn't I? Or no, I wasn't. Okay, good. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind, never mind. Um, and we're gonna sell the fish. Actually, wait. No, I'm not gonna sell the fish. I oh, know we'll sell the fish because we'll, we'll do some more fishing later. I was gonna keep this for the um events that I know are coming up, but we will fish later. We'll fish later and we'll get some more fish. So don't need to worry about that. But yeah, let's go ahead and head down to the blacksmith. You guys have not seen the blacksmith yet. Um, we're gonna go ahead down to the blacksmith and hopefully um, be able to bust open these three geos that we have. Um, and, and some good stuff is usually in there. Sometimes it's just coal. Oh, it's today. This is the day. Oh, guys, guys, it's Mary Lewis. Oh, hi there. It's the Pelican Town Center. Holy. What an eyesore. Yeah, it's pretty run down. Not gonna lie. This is the Pelican Town Community Center. Or what's left of it anyway. Yeah, it looks pretty shabby, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. It used to be the pride and joy of the town. Always bustling with activity. Now, now it looks like this, I suppose, huh? Now, just look at it. It's shameful. Yeah. These days, young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. That's a shame. Don't you just hate that? You gotta get out there and, and, and explore, you know? Uh, but listen to me. I sound like an old fool. No, no, I, I understand what you're coming from. Georgia Corporation has been handling, uh, hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Oh, see, this is what I was talking about. We're, no, we gotta save the town, guys. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Ah, uh, well. If anyone else buys a Joja Co. membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. Oh no. Okay, well, we're not, we're definitely not buying a Joja Corporation membership, so don't you worry, Lewis. Uh, here, let's go inside. Yeah, let's go inside. Let's check this bad boy out real quick. Oh man. Yeah, I was I was I was wondering what day it was. Like I, I I forgot that it was this day. So we're gonna go ahead and check out the community center today. Check this out. Oh, this place. Holy. Spooky. Hmm? What's this? I guess Vincent and Jess must have been playing here. All the two the two kids, I guess. Yeah. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. <laughs> place is pretty run down. Oh my God, there's an apple. Lewis, turn around. It's a waving apple. What? It... What? It was right there, I swear. I'm not crazy. What's the matter? Are you ill? No, it... Oh my... 
there was an apple. It was right here. And it was green. Like my face. It was right there. I'm... What? You saw some? Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. No, it wasn't a rat. It was... It, there it is again! Turn around! Oh my goodness gracious. You worried me, Sapo, for me. Yeah, 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 we know. Uh, look, I'm gonna head home. I, I need some lunch. Yeah, you go get some lunch. There's a green apple around here somewhere. Eat it if you find it. Hey, I I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. It's not a rat! It's an apple! You know, the variety you get off of trees. But ones that are green instead of the generic red ones. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Yes, we will. We will. He doesn't understand. <laughs> There's just apples running free in here that's scaring me. All right, anyway. That is the town center. Um, and... There's some actually while we're here, we might as well go ahead and put some of these stuff this the stuff in here. Now I know for spring, there's these little packets that we have to do. Um bundles, I think they're called. Um, and if we don't do them before the time, before the the the, the season is over with, then we have to wait until next season. There's another one. Um so yeah, this is the this is the bundles. It's written in some alien language or something. Um And I don't I just watered it. I don't even know. Can we not? Oh, I don't think I can do it. Oh, no. Well, that's a stinker. Yeah, but we're supposed to be collecting things for bundles. And then putting it in the bundles. I don't remember what we need for them, though. Um, I know we need, like, a, a you know, a daffodil, wild horseradish, blah, blah, blah. But I don't remember what some of the other ones were. Um, oh, hey, look, it's you. Sebastian. What? I didn't hear you. I'm busy thinking about something. Yeah, uh, yeah, okay, just be on your way then, Sebastian, all right, bud? Anyway, um, the blacksmith. Let's go to the blacksmith first. The mine is up here. Man, we're just all over the place today. What is up, Linus? What's going on, man? How's, how's it going? You, you, you hanging in there? Yep, yep. It's, it's each day, one day at a time. All right, um, this is not the way. Yeah, well, let's go to the blacksmith first and get rid of these geodes, and then we can uh, hop into the mine for a second. Now, I don't want to do too much in the mines. Because I don't want to just head down there and just start fighting things, you know, like we're playing Undermine or something. Um, I'm gonna play Stardew Valley today, you know. Um, but I do want to go check out the mines and show you guys what the mines are all about. Because there is some fighting in Stardew Valley, if you guys didn't know. So, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and head, head up and do that. But I want to do this, this, these geodes first. We can get a lot of good minerals from this. We probably won't get anything too good. But, alright. Uh, process geodes. Alright, yeah, 25 gold each. What's that one? Oh, just a regular rock. Great, wonderful. What's that one? Ooh! What's that? Ooh! Petrified slime! Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate to the museum. That's pretty good. What's that? Oh, okay, that's iron. Right, that's iron. Co copper, yeah, that's what I meant. Alright, good. So, I mean, you can you can take the you can take the rock, like. Here, I'm just gonna give him a rock. Merry Christmas. Sigh. He didn't want that rock, oh god! Oh, man, he did not want that rock at all. He was like, oh, a rock. This guy's giving me a rock again. This guy. Oh, I thought this was him over here. Oh, that's, that's what's his face. That's the doctor guy. All right, um, donate to museum. I got a thingy for you. Put that right next to the other one. There we go. Now we can check that bad boy out. What it all about? What it all about? Uh, petrified slime, this little guy. Uh, maybe a hundred thousand years old. Holy! Wow. Well, now we know it's a hundred thousand years old. A lot of information there. A lot of information there. Got it. Got to tell you. It's, it's, it's uh, 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 amazing amount of information. So much you couldn't even read it in a book. You know, you c you couldn't read that much information in a book. It would just it, it, it would the book would be a million pages long. That's that's a lot of information. 100,000 years old. Jeez, I could barely finish that sentence. It was so long. <laughs> well, let's head up to the mines. Sometimes the descriptions of the museum stuff, that's one of the only complaints I have about Stardew Valley. Like I said, I haven't played through the entire game before, um, but that's one of the complaints that I have about Stardew Valley is that, um, is that the descriptions are not long enough. 
like the description is a sentence long. Like, what's that about? All right, head to the mines. Let's do it. All right. Oh, hello. How are you? Huh. My name is Apophe Me. Hello, I'm here to go into the mine shaft. Do you mind? Haha, <laughs> get it? Do you mind? <laughs> I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. He's been abandoned for decades. That's his voice. 100%. There's still probably good ore down there. But a dark place undisturbed for so long. I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Yep, that's his voice. That's what I'm doing from now on. That's that's what Marlin sounds like. Here, take this. You might need it. Glorious voice he has right there. We got a sword. Oh my god. We got a rusty sword, guys. But do some damage to some slimes. Name's Marlin, by the way. I run the Adventures Guild right outside. <laughs> I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself in. You might uh think about making you a member. He's got like this weird thing where he pauses between every word. Like, what's going on with that? All right, let's head down. Oh, man. All right, hold on. Let me rearrange. Now we got the sword. I can rearrange my inventory the way that I wanted to before. Um, Like this. There we go. All right. Now, the thing about mines is that you got to find where the, where, the, where the ladder is to go down. All right, cool. That was easy. Um... So yeah, you gotta find where the ladder is, and sometimes you gotta break rocks, sometimes it's just out in the open. But the issue is, is we only have a little bit of stamina over on the right hand side, the energy bar. We have an energy bar and a health bar, now. We, have a, oh, we have a health bar now, but we only had an energy bar before, and we have to make sure that that doesn't go all the way down before we get out of here. Because if it goes all the way down and we get out of here, then, and we don't get out of here, then we get stuck down here. And um, we're gonna lose some items, because someone's gonna take us back home, and they're gonna be like, Hey, I found you down in the mine! What were you doing? She went to sleep. <laughs> and uh, it wouldn't be not good. It would be not good for us. Um, I'm gonna eat the algae because I know it restores some energy, so I can free up a space. Um, and I'm gonna pick up this quartz. Hello. Oh, it's bug meat. Ew. Okay. Um, man, we really need that big backpack. Holy. Um, I'm gonna get rid of the one dandelion because I know we have a lot of those at home i just want to go down to the fifth i want to get to the fifth level in the mines and we're gonna have to i i should be picking up these rocks but listen listen it's okay um i'm definitely gonna have to grab something else for that coal this stuff is like not difficult to get but it's just a pain to keep coming back for you know um, oh man, I don't want to drop anything. I'm just gonna drop the bug meat. Yeah, we're gonna do, we don't really need bug meat right now. And that's easy to get, because the bugs always respawn. So, I'm not worried about that. But coal, coal do not be spawning too often. It be not spawning sometimes when it do not be doing that. So, we're gonna get all the stuff that we can. Get out of here. Get, jeez, you guys are way tougher than other games where there's slimes. Holy moly, get out, get get out of here. We're only doing one damage which eat with each of these, unless we do three, which is critical. Oh, that's tree sap right there. I don't really, really need it. I can get that, you know, from trees. <laughs> Instead of in a barrel in a mine shaft. Got those sappy barrels. And not the sappy kind, like like you know, the the romantic kind. I mean like sappy, like you know, actual sap, you know, from trees and whatnot. Like that kind. Oh, there's torches down here. All right, we're on the fourth level. Every five levels, there's a there's an elevator, so we can. It's like a checkpoint. Because if we were to leave right now, then we couldn't come back to this location. We would have to go through all five of the the mines that we just went through, all four of the mines we just went through again, which would not be fun because I don't want to do it over again. So we gotta get to at least five every single time we come down here. So five, ten, fifteen, twenty, you know, yada yada, so forth and so on. You know, you know what I mean. Oh, he hit me. He got he got me good. Oh god. They both got me. Oh, I'm getting tag teamed. I'm getting tag teamed from both directions. Get out of here. Uh, 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 uh. Not gonna happen again. You're not gonna hit me again. Ah, I told you. Uh yeah, buddy. Alright, where's this where's this ladder at? Holy. Listen to that noise. It's just so ambient down here, it's crazy. Oh, there it is. There we go. That's the elevator. You hear that little noise? Yeah. So now we can leave now. I don't want to keep doing this. Um, so we can go back up to zero. 
so yeah we gotta get, get to at least um increments of five every single time we do a mine shaft run because i don't want to have to redo mines because that's not fun ever so oh my god she's playing the flute holy moly hello i can't talk to her she's playing the flute i wish there was actual music you could hear when you walk close to her that'd be really cool oh guys look it's it's robin and demetrius the married couple they're, they're just hanging out just looking at the ocean or the whatever this is over here don't know what we're looking at but i'm gonna i'm gonna keep looking at it with you yep this is i enjoy this guys don't know if you guys also enjoy this, but I, I I enjoy the time we're spending right now. I really appreciate this time. You know, some, t some, t some people take this time for granted. You know, I would never take our time, our special time of looking at whatever the heck we're looking at. I don't know for granted. I would never do that. I would never take this time for granted. It means a lot to me, but listen, I got stuff to do, so I'll see you guys later, all right? Okay. Yeah, we're going we're gonna, to gonna head, on, head on home. <laughs> It's 6.30 p.m. Holy, it's not even dark yet. That's because it's spring, you know. It's not dark at 6.30 in spring. All right, we're going to head home. And hopefully, um, maybe, like, catch a fish or two. I don't know. But we sold the parsnip, so we should have a little bit of money. I can't believe I, I forgot to throw those in the bin in the last episode. That was really dumb of me. But whatever. We do it now. Better late than never, you know. It's fine. It's not going anywhere. All right. Now, we don't have enough of anything to craft. Um, what do you need for a furnace? Oh, I can't craft a furnace yet. We, we, need, we need to unlock that first. Okay. We can craft a furnace, but I have to unlock it first. Okay, so we're going to... Um, I'm going to dump... No, I was going to dump something in the bin, but no, nah, just, just forget it. We'll just, we'll just go to sleep now. I think this, we'll cut this episode a little bit short. 16-ish minutes, 17 minutes. Uh, yeah, yeah, that'll be, that'll be good. It's just now getting dark anyway. Did quite a few things today. We got some, uh, we, we broke up into geodes. We donated to the museum. Uh, checked out the mine shaft and, of course, the, uh, you know, the town center. So, next episode, we're probably gonna do some more fishing. See if we can get some more money, because I need a bigger backpack, because, yeah, this, these, these, these spaces, yeah, that's not it. We need more than that. We need more than that. Um... But yeah, we should probably unlock some more things right now um, in the nighttime while we're sleeping. So, yeah, I'm going to turn the fireplace back on for nighttime. Oh, it just got dark. Wow, incredible. Fire starter, fire starter. All right, there we go. Let's, let's go ahead and sleep. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. I enjoyed it. You guys apparently are loving Stardew Valley. I'm happy you guys are enjoying Stardew Valley and all the videos, all the content. You guys seem, seem to love the videos recently. Uh, yeah, so we're going to... We're going to pick up right here in the next episode. I'll see you guys later. Uh, peace out. We're going to go to sleep. See how much money we made real quick before we end this bad boy. Oh, $525.75 for the fish. So 600 in total. A perfect even 600 Which means we're going to have like 1,000 something. Because I think we had 444 coins. So we'll have like 1,044 coins, I think. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. I will see you in the next one. But I will I, I'll, yeah, I'll see you. I'll see you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I'll see you guys in the next episode. But, but you know, I'll see you there. Yeah. That, that didn't make sense. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Peace out, guys. <laughs> Peace out.